Hey, what's up everyone? Wanted to hop on here, do a quick video about my KitchenAid stand and mixer set. Uh, this one here I think is in the sour apple color. Uh, my wife and I, we registered this back when we got married back in 2016, and it has gotten a lot of use since. So this is what's called a six year update. Uh, this one does come with the mixing bowl, does come with the uh, this little plastic guard here and inside the bowl. Let's see if I can pick this up here with one hand. Um, oh, there's the lock here on the side. So if that's unlocked, you can actually bring this up. And it also comes with the, the standard mixer, uh, the standard mixing attachment. This is a kneading, I think it's called a kneading hook when we make bread. I don't know, I've never made bread unless my wife does. She's telling me this is a this is a kneading hook. And then it also comes with the uh, with the whisk attachment as well. And the as you can see, these attachments here are all keyed so that they stay securely on the mixer. Essentially, there's a there's a little pin here, if you see this on the, on, the, on the mixer. Basically this hops in here, goes in with the key. Where's a, you basically line the keyhole up here at the top, comes in and then it's a twist. Hold on, it's there, it's a twist. Let me see if I can do this one-handed. And then there you go, now you're, uh, now you're keyed in. Uh, to do this there, now the bowl is actually attaches, there's actually a groove when you basically just twist it and it comes off, I don't know, it's, there's like a little bit of a lip on the bottom of the bowl is a lip in here. So this comes in, it's a nice little twist. Again, ah, a little interesting to do one handed. I got my phone in the other, but once that's on there, that's not going anywhere. And because I said that, that's definitely not going anywhere. Uh, come in here, you also got, uh, again, you go up here, there's a bunch of speeds on the side. Here, let me plug it in real quick. All right, now that we're all plugged in, you've actually got your speeds here on the side. There's a slowest stir setting. And then if you crank it all the way up, I've never used it on this besides this video. It, uh, it goes pretty fast. I don't think we've ever used this past like the four setting or the six setting, but uh, there is a lot of extra juice. Uh, the stand also has a power takeoff here for accessories, which you can actually go and see other videos of this. Uh, but this, I have a bunch of, there's like a, there's a spiralizer, there's a meat grinder that goes on this. There's a bunch of stuff and this is actually where, uh, where the gear is, where it actually attaches. Um, as far as serviceability on these kitchen aids, yes, they are more expensive than an average blender or stand mixer, but these are very serviceable. Uh, there are kitchen aid techs all the time. In fact, you can actually, uh, these screws, the, this, you know, they always say they don't make them like they used to the, they build these like they used to, they're able to be serviced. So there's all kinds of screws and all these covers come off, uh, the screws right back here. And the, uh, all this cover comes off and all the gears and all the mechanical, bits inside of here are all serviceable they're all replaceable so if it breaks it can be repaired and you're not shopping for a new kitchen aid which is really really nice because this thing we're going to have for many 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 years to come so overall i recommend picking one up